Ascanio Sobrero was an Italian chemist, born in Casal Monferrato. He was studying under Tessafal Jules Palouse at the University of Turin, who had worked with the explosive material gun cotton. He studied medicine in Turin and Paris and then chemistry at the University of Gleason with Justice Liebig, and earned his doctorate in 1832. In 1845 he became professor at the University of Turin during his research he discovered nitroglycerine. He initially called it pyroglycerine, and warned vigorously against its use in his private letters and in a journal article, stating that it was extremely dangerous and impossible to handle. In fact, he was so frightened by what he created that he kept it a secret for over a year. Another of Palouse's students was the young Alfred Nobel, who returned to the Nobel family's defunct armaments factory and began experimenting with the material around 1860. It did, indeed, prove to be very difficult to discover how to handle it safely. In the 1860s Nobel received several patents around the world for mixtures, devices and manufacturing methods based on the explosive power of nitroglycerine, eventually leading to the invention of dynamite, ballistite and gelignite from which he made a fortune. Although Nobel always acknowledged and honored Sobrero as the man who had discovered nitroglycerine, Sobrero was not only dismayed by the uses to which the explosive had been put, but also on occasion claimed that he was not given sufficient recognition. 